Appreciation Week and welcome to the WPINE Morning News. Today is Friday, May 6th. I'm Abby. And I'm Charlie. Let's start our day calm, focused, and balanced with a brief moment of silence. Thank you. Now our pledge helpers for Mr. Canby's class are here to lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance. All faculty and students, please stand for the pledge. Attention, salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, <laughs> indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thanks, pledge helpers. Now we will have our morning announcements. Our time together this school year is running out, so if you haven't ordered a yearbook yet, now is the time. Have your parents check last week's Friday forecast for the link to order. Your books will be distributed this the week of May 16th, and we will have a few more on sale here at school for $35 each. It's that time of year again. It's time to register for next school year. Ask your parents if they have registered you online already. If not, remind them that they have to fill out a registration form online so that, they, so that you can be placed in a class ne for next year. If, you, if they have any questions, tell them to call Ms. Marichon in the front office. Viking Youth Football, Refined. Free Clinics at Spartanburg High School, Saturday, April 30th and Saturday, May 14th. 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. No commitment required to attend. Come see what it's all about for yourself. Have your parents check out the link in last week's Friday forecast to see if you're interested in participating. We're rolling into PSS Bike to School Day. Bike to School Day will be Wednesday, May 11th. If you have a good and safe path to school, you can ride from home or you can meet our group at the rail trail. We will leave from the YMCA end of the rail trail at about 7:10 a.m. Students will ride on the trail to school and finish with a lap around the track. Breakfast, order, and money and permission slips are due today. BTSD is always a fun event and we look forward to seeing you and starting our day with a healthy and fun activity. Did you know? All of the bricks near our main office entrance are professionally engraved and installed each year. They make great gifts for graduating fifth graders, teachers, staff, alumni, and families. All bricks are $100. Have your parents see last week's Friday forecast if you're interested in getting a brick. You may want to remember these important dates coming up. May 11th, Bike to School Day at PSS. May 19th, Late Stay Day for Teachers. May 19th, rising five-year-old kindergarten, pop in for a popsicle, 4 o'clock to 5.30 p.m. May 20th, baseball day for fifth grade. May 20th, SHS senior walk at PSS, 10.30 a.m. May 24th, late stay day for teachers, parent conferences if needed. May 25th, fifth grade honors program at 9 o'clock a.m. May 25th, fifth grade oh the places you'll go at 6.30 p.m. May 26th, half day dismissal at 11.30 a.m. May 27th, half day dismissal at 11.30 a.m., last day of school. May 30th, Memorial Day, happy summer vacation. And last but not least, remember to wear your PSS gear every Friday for School Spirit Day. Let's go to special correspondent Taraji to see what's for lunch and how's the weather today. Good morning, everyone. I'm Taraji. Today's lunch will be chicken and waffles, classic cheese pizza, and yogurt and cheese fun lunch. Remember, white milk or water are always the healthiest drink choices. 
yummy. Now let's take a look at today's weather. Today is supposed to be raining with a, with a high of 85 degrees and a low of 64 degrees and a 70% chance of precipitation. Now let's see who's celebrating their birthday today. Hello, I'm Crispin. Happy birthday to Broden Mitchell on May 6th. Parker Watt Wall and Ella Jane Brown on May 7th. Happy birthday, everyone. Come get your birthday tree from the office. Please forgive me if I mispronounced your name. Starting today, we'll be having a special student spotlight. Today's feature is Braxton Miller and Mi Mrs. Hoffman's cl fifth grade class. Braxton was selected to be the PSS Boys and Girls Club Youth of the Year, and we interviewed him this week. Let's take a look. Hi Braxton, thanks for joining us. So first off, tell us, what is Youth of the Year? Youth of uh, the Year is a contest between four or more people across the district, schools, or the whole entire state. And how did you win Youth of the Year? I won it because I practiced, um, I wrote a very excellent essay, and um, yeah, practice. Uh, why do you think you won Youth of the Year? I think I won because um, I really concentrated and put lots of time into um, it, and I like really try to make an effort, and yeah. Thank you. Uh, Tell us a fun fact about yourself. Um, my middle name is Blaze. Well, thank you for joining us, Braxton. For WPIME Morning News, I'm Abby. And I'm Charlie. Thanks for watching. See you again next week, and stay tuned for some footage from this past week's special events. Dance party! Knock, knock. Who's there? W Pine. W Pine who? W Pine Morning News. That's who. It's our student-led school news show. We have a new episode each Friday. Cool. How do I find that? Just go to YouTube and search for W Pine Pine Street School News. Then click subscribe. Awesome. I can't wait to watch. Good morning, Pine Street School. It is the beginning of May, but these are our terrific kids for the month of April. That means they were terrific during spring break and the whole month. They've been helpful to their classmates and used good manners and been polite and respectful. All of the good things. So I'm going to start with first graders and recognize them. In Ms. Hare's class, it's Caden Cox, but he's absent today, but he's still terrific. And then we have Julia Collins in Ms. Powell's class, Olivia Bradford in Ms. Shelton's class, Graham Bozard in Ms. Wolf's class, Zamir Rice in Ms. Cooper's class, and Rebecca White in Ms. Phillips' class. Congratulations, everybody. Here we have our terrific kids for the month of April for second grade. I'm very proud of them, and they should be proud of themselves. In Ms. Anderson's class, Addison Miller. In Ms. Borowski's class, Garrett Hargett. In Ms. Fisher's class, Hayes Jacobs. In Ms. Yurkovich's class, Bobby Flandry. In Ms. Blaney's class, Emma Holliday. And in Ms. Holmes's class, Mavis Penny. Congratulations, second grade. Here are our terrific third graders. I'm so proud of them, and I know that they should be proud of themselves, and their teachers are proud of them. And we have Susanna Story in Ms. Davis's class, Jakari Richardson in Ms. Hinkle's class, Carter Littlejohn in Ms. Butterhorn's class, Alec Rasumovich in Ms. Patrick's class, Sally Wilcox in Ms. Gilstrap's class, and Amelia Fortner in Ms. Boyd's class. Terrific third graders, awesome. These are our fourth grade terrific kids for the month of 
April <laughs> um, at Pine Street. I'm very proud of them. Jefferson Rousey is terrific, but he's out today and he's in Miss Rogers' class. But we do have in Miss Bullington's class, Milan Hartman. In Miss Caldwell's class, Landon Hargett. In Miss Grimes' class, Harry Clayton. And in Miss McRoberts' class, Lorelai Bacchino. Congratulations to these fourth grade terrific kids. These are Pine Street's fifth grade terrific kids, and this is for the month of April. And I'm so proud of all of them. In Miss Hoffman's class, it's Ryan Osman. In Miss Sprinkles' class, Lucas Smith. In Miss Volk's class, Kennedy Lindsay Peeler. And in Mr. Cammy's class, Lauren Roos. And Miss Bradford's class, Cora Walkansick. Congratulations, fifth graders, and all of our terrific kids. Y'all have a great day.